concerts. I do one old folks home a week to practice. Hey, they're a tough crowd. They know all the songs. Does anybody out there have any songs where you use five five notes in a chord? Richard? Uh, you caught me off guard, John. I'm sorry. Anybody? Five notes in a chord. I never knew any either. But I'm going to quickly, this is a one minute aside. I'm not going to do the clarinet polka tonight. But there are six five note chords in clarinet polka. Here they are. Now, instead of doing the run, you do a cascade. You just hang on to them until you got your chord. So here are the only five note chords I've ever seen. There's an eight, a seven, a couple of nines, even a ten. <laughs> Finger stretch, which means that my max is eleven. <laughs> okay, but still, here are those finger chords very quickly from the clarinet polka, just once because I found it so neat. I was preparing in case Walter was here. So, clarinet polka. <laughs> He's on his way, Mario from Sorrento, and he stopped in Amutonia to visit an old music professor, Elio Pietro Viola. And he said, Listen, will you write a little song for Marianne so when I go back, she won't be pissed off at me? And so here's the little Marian Waltz written by Pietro Elio Viola. <laughs> Thank you. 
crowd to the carnival in Venice. He could even hear the music going on, the partying. <laughs> Now remember, La Traviata is the story about a small 
thin, young, wasting away young woman of consumption. Not a particularly happy story he's got to turn this into. Tough gig. So, here it is. La Traviata, scene going up. Verdi, you said... Oh, wrong one.
damn way he can't remember the rest of his stag. <laughs> Thanks so much, John. That was a nice start. Medley song.